Hi everyone, and I am sitting down here. It's Monday. It's not usually a day that I post, but I also posted yesterday, which was a Sunday, uh, and I posted a video about my insecurities. You guys, I am so, 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 so overwhelmed by your support and by all your comments. And that is why I just could not not make this video. And thank you for sharing your problems, your thoughts, the things that, you know, bother you with me because I know how difficult it can be to open up. At the end of the day, I do sit in front of the camera and talk to myself and you feel very secure because you don't even know if you're gonna post this video or not because that's exactly how I felt with that one. I wasn't sure if I actually want to put it out there because it's vulnerability. No one wants to feel vulnerable in front of other people. You know, you don't wanna show weaknesses, but I don't consider insecurities and things that sometimes you know, put me in a bad mood my weaknesses. I think that as long as I can say them out loud and accept them and try to deal with them uh, and acknowledge them, I am turning them into a strength. And that's exactly what I think many of you did yesterday when you replied to that video. When I was filming, I didn't even know how that video will come across. I didn't know if I'm getting my message across because that's what happens when I get really emotional and when I get frustrated with something, I completely lose the line of thoughts and I even forget what this video is meant to be about. And yeah, like I said, when I sit in front of the camera and just talk to myself, it's one thing when I put post a video and expose myself to potentially thousands or you know ten thousands of people that's a completely different story but I would like to be there for you as much as you were there for me because um, that was such an emotional release that video for me I had a very very difficult emotionally difficult day yesterday uh, I had emotions coming out that I didn't even know were there. That's why I just want to say a massive, massive thank you once again for supporting me through this and for being there for me. And I would absolutely love to be there for you. If you want to talk about anything, if you want to share anything at all, you can always message me. You can always connect with me on Instagram. Or, you know, just leave your comments and I would absolutely love to continue this journey with all of you guys. And I will keep posting, I will keep opening up, I will keep sharing. Because I feel like when an insecurity or something that is bothering you or negativity is shared, it's almost halved, right? So you only need to deal with half of it. At least that's how it feels for me. And like a lot of you said to me, you just never know what battles someone is fighting you know, behind a perfect Instagram page or a very successful YouTube channel. And that is why I will always try to stay true to myself. I will always try to be honest with you. I literally thought I will sit down, say thank you, you know, make this video 30 seconds and post it quickly. But it just really hit me quite hard, everything that you wrote and you shared. And it means the world to me and I'm not I don't, I don't say it lightly. Another reason why this means so much to me is because sometimes I feel very alone and that doesn't mean I don't have very supportive people around me, but my family is very far. I live um, in UK, obviously, and the only person that I actually have here is Jay. And sometimes you don't want to burden them with some negative thoughts that you're having or the worries or insecurities, whatever. And that's kind of what I do. I definitely don't share half of the things that bother me. And, you know, my best friend is, lives in Estonia. I do have a few friends here that, you know, I see on a regular basis. But I just don't feel like I want to put that burden on other people of sharing my emotions. And that's kind of always been... Um, a thing for me. So that is why opening up to you and you answering back was such a big and important thing. So I'm gonna wrap this up because I don't even know where I'm going with this and I'm gonna like start crying and get really emotional again and that's not what I wanted to do. I just wanted to thank you and I hope you're all having a wonderful, wonderful, positive, full of smiles day. I love you all very, very much. And I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye.